thanks for coming back. <laughs> yeah, been a struggle this spring, let's just say that. <laughs> this May can, <sighs> I'm excited for June, let's just say, I don't think it could yeah. be any worse, but. Um, we are at, chasing yeah. the beloved muskie once again here yep, today. Yep, yep. Uh, on a body of water we haven't hit yet this year, had a little bit of success last year. It's a fun body of water. Um, should be nice and warm, should be ready to rock for some top water action, maybe. Look at this. How could we not throw top water out here yeah. today? It's like perfect. It's just screaming top water. Yep, flat calm, a little bit of sun, some clouds. You like that early spring. You've had great success flat tailing in this kind of yeah. partly sun kind of deal. Definitely doesn't have to be cloudy. I like this kind of filtered sun. Uh, I also like the fact that we've got a little bit of color to the water, like probably two weeks ago yeah. or less, this was really clear water yep. here and like a pretty much musky aquarium. So um, We got a little well, bloom now, so yeah. it's looking good. Liking that. Um, we'll see. We'll, we're gonna see what happens. Can't go get any worse, uh, I'll just say. <laughs> well, I've had one musky bite in probably the last, I don't know, well, since I was down south with you. Yeah. So yep. uh, it's, been, it's been about a minute. So, let's go. Let's do it. Okay, folks, gonna get this show on the road. What have we got in the Lakewood today? Robbie, what do you got rolling? Walk the dog, fish stick. Ooh, fish stick. Regular or HD size? Big one. The, old big... the big dog. All right, Robbie's going top. I'm going downstairs. Um, I don't know what color to throw right now, but I am going to throw a mini boiler maker. Well, there's a little filtered sun. I'll tell you what, I'm just going to go old standard black nickel. You know, it's kind of crazy how black nickel bucktails have become not as popular as of late. It's more black with black nickel blades. So these fish are not seeing black <laughs> yeah, nickel uh, or not seeing regular nickel. So we're going to go with regular nickel. Be throwing that on the nine foot surgical strike. Tranks 400. Slow gear. Where's my sunglasses? Okay, almost stepped on those. Okay, Robbie, I'm going to try musky fishing again. Let, let's see how this goes. Wish me luck. Okay, and we're off. Wet our line down so it casts better. And I am now musky fishing. Well, folks, a little update for you. We've managed to pound for a couple hours out here and have saw one lazy musky just paddle off from the boat. Um, it's sunny, it's calm. It was supposed to be cloudy, cool chance of rain. Uh, we've not seen any things shallow. So what we're going to do is something that uh, works really well, especially on kind of smaller to medium sized lakes, is you come out to the middle of the lake, the deepest water in the lake. Uh, a lot of the lakes that have basins that are, you know, say 25 to maybe 45 feet. Uh, early in the season like this, when you first get that warm up, you'll get that water temperature real high, just right up on the top level, especially a calm day like today. Um, and a really good technique is throwing rubber over the base, and that's exactly what we're going to do here. Uh, we've done this on multiple bodies of water, and have had great success, but uh, as of now, we're not having great success, so we got to try something different. All right, so folks, a little change up on the rod. We've got a, is that hot? It's hot. Okay, good. <laughs> we've got a nine foot six assault stick in the SWAT model. Telescoping. I don't know, I kind of like this little longer rod because a lot of the fish will come in deep on the figure eight on this technique, this mid-lake basin fishing. Uh, I've got the uh, slower tranks here, the 400A, which is the 5.8 gear ratio. And uh, it helps me keep the bait a little bit deeper. You know, we want to run this bait probably in the six to maybe 10 feet, just kind of depends where you're seeing the bait. But one thing I've done different on this reel is I've switched it to the single power handle. Uh, the reel comes with the double paddle handle. I don't know, with like bucktails and beside like this, I kind of like this single handle. Um, I don't know, that's what I like, so that's what I'm using. Please bite musky, because I can't take this anymore.
just so you folks at home know this, we feel just like this, as I'm sure you guys have felt like this before. There is no way possible to even think about catching a muskie right now in this lifetime. I don't even know what I'm doing here. Here we go. That was a good one. Squirted in behind it. Yeah. As soon as we got a little wind switch. Is that a southeast now? I, have no idea. I don't know either. But that was a muskie that just came in behind my glider here. Oh, okay. Moving right along. There's a muskie. He's heading left. Oh, here you go. Got him, got him. Oh, no. That are, was him. Are you kidding me? That was him. We literally cast it at that follow, and I saw him sneak up, and he ate it. And I lost it. That's so awesome. Oh, why? Why? I would love to catch that thing. It wasn't that. It was 30 plus. I would have reeled it in. A bit. On the old Lee Lures Leviathan, pretty big bait for this time of year, but that little guy was not scared of it. But wow, I watched him sneak in and <laughs> grabbed it. Wow, he's just porpoise and he bit. Another lost muskie. Yeah, for those of you wondering or have commented, yeah, those fish never bite, do they? Yes, they do. If you know where a muskie is, you cast at it. Well. That's action from two muskies in, I don't know, about 20 minutes or so. Robbie managed to get a bite on the uh, Levi, so, and I managed to follow. So I'm going to go Levi too. Why not? Why not? Is that okay with you, Robbie? That's okay. That's not going to offend me. Okay. Thank you, Robbie. Now, oh, I'm going to pull the old double leader trick, too. How about this? We got our big steel leader. I'm just going to attach that right to my floral leader. Why the hell not? Well, guys, can you tell that it's past moon? <laughs> Lee's sitting down, enjoying a little, what is that, some Jimmy John's? Got some Jimmy John's. That's pretty. Ham and cheese. Yeah. And, and uh, some caffeine. Little wow. caffeine, little clutch action. There you go. I need some help. <laughs> and really what I need is the fast forward of time to sunset, please, because I am presently melting right now. Oh, it is just so flat calm right now. At least at moon, we had a little bit of a ripple. Felt okay to be fishing, but right now, Oh, brutal, absolutely brutal. I might be joining Lee in a second. Dude. Robbie. <laughs> Another one goes down. How many, how many cans of sun drop do you need back there? <laughs> More. Ah. Uh. Oh, yeah. There you go, kid. There we go. At least it's diet. There we go. Hooked. I got a... Got me a Waldo. Okay, man. I am on the board. Big time, Robbie. Big time. Got myself... A little stalker Waldo. Front hook, boy, she just, she really lunched it. Look at her, look at her. Robbie, look at her, she really lunched it. You know what they always say about small fish? Wow, what a pretty fish. Pretty one. Look, it's a flathead walleye. What are you doing? <laughs> Thanks, buddy. Whoa, jumper.
Well guys, it is the last spot of the day pretty much. And uh, Lee and I are both rocking flaps because what else would you do if you're struggling all day and have not had much action? We have been saved many times before. Hopefully tonight we'll be saved too. Well, I think it's safe to say, Lee and I hate muskies. Wow. We are so sorry we are doing this to you. Yeah. Tell you what, if you made it this far, please go down and give us a thumbs down. We want to see <laughs> if we can get a record number of thumbs down for this video. Oh, We would really sucks. appreciate it. really appreciate it. that. Well, yeah, that sucked. <sighs> but you know what? It's May muskies. That's going to be our excuse, I guess. But I don't know. Should have been a good day, but... It wasn't. it wasn't, it wasn't, it really wasn't. Uh, June is just around the corner, so hopefully these muskies will wake up Can't soon. get much worse, that's no, for sure. No, it won't get much worse, I hope, because uh, I don't know how many more times we can go out and have this happen to us. <sighs> By the way, we haven't had a follow in 4.5 hours, probably longer yeah, than that now. Yep, yep, so, I don't know, we but don't we get it. But we did see some porpoise and pop up around yeah. us, so we know they're around us yep. right now. We're in the right area, it's just not not good. So guys, Very please sorry. please hit that dislike button. And um, yeah, we'll see you on the next musky hunt. Hopefully it's better. <laughs>